Day two. Not that it means anything. I'm a little frustrated right now. I've been doing doubles. Stop it, get back here. It ran away. I've been doing doubles every day now, except for Christmas. For, what, two, three weeks? I don't know. I, I Seriously, I've lost track of time. I have been working from 6.30 in the morning to 2 o'clock in the afternoon, from 2 o'clock in the afternoon to 10.30, which basically, my shift, it, it ends at 10.30, but basically, I'm gone by 9, 9.30. Um, but then lately, dang, hold please. So, lately, I've been staying till 1.30 in the morning, so basically 6.30 in the morning to 1.30 in the morning. So I get home exhausted, I take a shower, go to bed. Most of the time I'm waking up and my hair's still wet. Which is not a good thing for your hair. Sorry, hiccups. <sighs> my keyboard's dirty. Anyways, stay in focus, Angie. Um, so you got that. So here I have been working all these doubles and I know if I stop and say, okay, I need to take a break, I need at least a day off, I lose all my double. So basically, if I take off tomorrow from work, everything forward is straight time. And I don't want to do that because I'm on double time right now. So, okay, I got that. So money. Money makes the world go round. Gotcha. Understand. I learned that this September. Not that I believe it, but I was told, not told, I was shown that money is the root of all evil, evil and that uh, if you don't have money, you basically don't get anything. Like everything you wanted sarcastic Angie not coming out exactly just more like rude Angie so here I got that then I'm going to work and I'm hungry because I'm not making anything here so I have to eat the shit that's at work and you know it wouldn't be bad if it was decent stuff but it's Sbarro's it's Burger King how much can you possibly eat I feel like that guy that uh, was in Biggie Size, Biggie Size Me, I think it's called, uh, where I'm constantly gaining weight. And it, that's another thing is I've gained 12 pounds since I've done these doubles because I'm not eating clean. And I'm getting really frustrated because it's like, at what point do I just go, okay, I need to either take a day off and cook clean, but that's only going to give me three days of food because I won't eat food that's been in the, my fridge for more than three days. That's just my rule. So what do I do? Take a day off and, um, you know, basically eat and take care of myself and lose the doubles, or do I just keep on going for another week and a half and possibly gain five more pounds because I'm eating the shit at work, like egg sandwich, egg salad sandwiches with who knows what's in it, or Sbarro's pizza with so much grease you can probably realign your entire car with, or you know, do I go to Burger King and go get another French toast breakfast? You know. Or, hey, let's go over to that other place that serves paste that's supposed to be sausage gravy over potatoes, white potatoes. Yeah, that's real healthy, right? As you can tell, I'm a little bit frustrated. So, at what point do I go, okay, what comes first? Do I come first? Or does doubles come first? Because doubles is a lot of money. By the time that this is all said and done, I'll have four paychecks more extra. I, that you just can't get that very often so it's like okay I kill myself I work out I do all this stuff and then of course my daughter's car is acting up so now I thinking that I'm gonna have an extra two hours to sleep tomorrow and then go to work early no I don't I have to wake up at five o'clock in the morning and here it's almost one o'clock in the morning and uh, I have to go to uh, charge her car up and take her to Larry H. Miller, which it will probably take us a couple times to get there because, of course, you have to, it's going to stall and it's we're going to have to recharge it every single time. And I'm sure that's not healthy for neither one of the cars, so I'm really not looking forward to it. And I should just go, you know what, screw it, I'm going to go get a uh, somebody to haul it over there. I should. I, I really should. But that's not thinking straight because, you know, got to save a little bit of money. But is it going to damage my car a little bit more? Can you really tell that I'm frustrated? Wow. I really sound like a bitch right now. Oh, and this is a fobble. I love this little character. I've had him forever. Does he look good on me? Uh, I've had him so long that his little teat, I call these his little colorful teats. Uh, one of the teats fell off. 
right there. Right. And then uh, the little frilly fell off right there. So it looks like a, I don't know. I don't know. I need to get another one. I love this because I keep it in my pocket and I just sit there and play with it. Especially when somebody frustrates me. Anyways, oh shit, five minutes and 20-something seconds. I'm so sorry. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good night.